Hello. Hey, everybody. It's time for Shadow of the Colossus. Ah, uh, Shadow of the Colossus. Shadow of the Colossus is going to make us feel so much better. Mm-hmm. So, uh, one announcement at the top. <laughs> it's my lovely horse. My lovely horse. One announcement at the top of this one. Yeah. Uh, on Friday, we don't. Maybe we'll do a trucks also in addition to this. We don't know yet, but um, we're doing a stream. There's going to be a stream in support of Critical Distance. So keep an eye out. Friday around seven o'clock EST. Yeah. Uh-huh. Watch us play some stupid video games. Yep, 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 yep. But for now, we're gonna watch. We're gonna you're gonna watch us play this stupid video game. Mm. And uh, this uh, this Colossus will probably take up the whole episode, but it, not like that much of it. So what I want to do is rehearse something. I have been concerned with the choreography of getting off off the horse while it is in motion, which is useful in Colossus fights, including this one. But look how stupid it looks. Ooh, that's not good. Yeah, so I think, I have a theory that the... I mean, you crossed yourself on the horse butt on your way down. Yeah, There's yeah. no getting around that. That, that too. But I'm, I'm going to see if I can find a way to make the dismount make sense, you know? Oh, okay. So, uh, I, I, I feel like I'm very much just along for the ride in this <laughs> endeavor of yours. Well, yeah, that's fine. I, Josh that's, started this up I, I had no remember. idea that this was going to be part of his destiny for the... I need to remember how to do the thing. I need to teach myself how to do the thing, it would seem. Uh, you couldn't have done this off camera, Schmucko? No, this is fun. All right. This is video games. This is what you, have to, you have to take the effort to make it look good. Okay. Um, Mr. O'Tour. <laughs> All right. If you're going to make it less fun, we can skip it. No, 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 no. no. I wouldn't dream of it. <laughs> I just keep galloping. I truly don't remember the button combination. It's, I, I thought it... I really did think I had it. Hmm. I, I think that you're underselling the... Sequence in which you jump off like a jack in the box. Shit! No, yeah, there's a charm to it, but I've done it enough times already. That time it looked like the horse should have bowled me over. Um, okay, well, step one. Maybe I can remember how to stand up straight on the horse. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you do it like that. Yeah, there you go. So I thought it was just do the same thing except to one side. Surfing on the horse. That appears to not be the case. No, that, that causes that you to turn. Causes you to duck. Some other button combination then. But what could it be? Oh boy, you know. If only this game came with a manual. <laughs> it did. It did come with a manual. I know. If only. If only. You had taken the time to Google this. Ah oh, man, like we could Google it now. There's nothing to stop us. Yeah, but you're you're right. This has taken on a certain gravitas of its own. <laughs> what else could this button combination possibly be? Have you tried using the shoulder buttons? Yes. Have you tried using the other shoulder buttons? Yes. <laughs> That's what I'm in the process of. How about the left stick? Have you tried using the left stick? Yes. <laughs> you do this by holding R1 and up. How about, right? how about all the buttons? All of them. Yeah. Uh, I, I'm going to go, I'm yeah. gonna go let's, Google. Let's I'm gonna Google it. Go, Maybe go we Google pause it. while we Google no, it. No, 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 all right. We'll, 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 get this, we'll get this nice shot of these birds. It's very beautiful. While, while Wander yeah. tries to figure out how to move his body the way he wants to. Man, it could be anything. And is it even useful? The answer is probably not. But it's important. It's important to make things look right. I'm, I'm truly, I have no idea. Okay, I'm going to use my mobile device. I think we did this earlier in this series. That's the really painful thing. You're I'm going to Google the phrase Colossus Manual. Uh, or how about just shout out the Colossus horse moves? I think that's what we need. Support for Colossus. Why, why are you... <laughs> we have no time Colossus to waste, Isaac. Virus. We have no time to waste. There we go. They want us to figure this out. Many blinking lights is yelling at us how to do this right now. I, I don't think that... I think that this is... Oh, okay. I'm hanging I on. figured it out. Oh, you did it? I did. Oh, sweet. So what happens if I jump S- off? Sweet. It, uh... <laughs> I think that's going to look okay, though. It looked like there was a bespoke animation for it. Let's Directly try that again. into the tree. Not bad. Hop. Oh. You, you have to do more to actually dismount, it would seem. Oh, it was, it was probably because I was continuing to hold R1 that that didn't work. Okay. Well, that's a straight drop. That looked okay. I'm downloading the PDF of the original Shadow of the Colossus users. Is it, let's see what it says about the storyline. Apparently, I can open this with the Diamond Dallas Page Yoga Now app. What the fuck? Hang on. Wow, there must be some. It looks like he's about to do a, a flying dismount there, but. Controls. Display walking, running, crouching, evading, jumping, swimming, climbing, whistling, mounting, and dismounting. That's it. Page 15. <laughs> That's what we want. He just grabs his horse. Jesus. <laughs> I'll grab your horse. What happens if I let go of R1? Um, hey, mount and dismount aggro with the triangle button. 
thank you. It's about faster to jump toward Argo and press the R1 button. Yes. Um, when riding home, when riding Homestuck, you can duck by holding the R1 button, stand by holding the R1 button, and up on the left analog stick. Guess what? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. This is not in the manual. Well, the whole go down to the side thing is not in the manual. Well, there you go. It's secret. Nope. You, we're doing what you were supposed to do. Yay! There we go. It's just 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 riding your horse in a safe place and figure out the technique. Okay, so we're a good five minutes into this episode now. Can we go and fight a Colossus, please? Oh my god. You're such Ennui a... has spurred me into bloodthirstiness, man. Such a such a, a bitter pill. <laughs> You're a bitter pill. <laughs> I'm having fun. Uh, do you want me to Google horse moves? No, whatever. I think what I've figured out so far... You will... wouldn't be playing as the author intended if you did that. I mean, I think what I've figured out so far will be sufficient. Okay. Is this the, is one of my favorite, and, and the goal is to make this look classy. Yeah, you know, to make it look not, not physically impossible. The th the way I get off the horse. You don't want to break your immersion. <laughs> I'm just trying to <laughs> trying to create good images, Isaac. You truly, you believe in this? Uh, yes, I do. I'm sorry. I don't know why I'm being such an old poop. I think it's because I haven't had dinner yet. Yeah, I'm sorry There's, you haven't had dinner yeah, yet. There's pasta waiting to be pasta. I went and got a haircut instead. Yeah. Uh, it's a. Uh, it's a pretty good haircut. It hides the fact that I'm losing my hair pretty okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, no, I think it looks good. Yep. And uh, and the I, I go to a barber shop with an actual barber, which I didn't do for most of my life because I'm an incredibly cheap <sighs> human being. I return straight into that tree without my input. Yeah, particularly when it comes to matters of... I'm sorry, I, I'm talking about my haircut. No, go on talking, talking about, about your haircut. It's basically trucks. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I went and had this haircut. And like these days I'm going to an actual barber because I feel the need as an adult man to invest in my appearance a tiny little bit which yeah. has always been kind of inimical to my personal philosophy <laughs> you know big old sweaty nerd that i am but i go to this guy and my favorite part of the whole experience like it's it's like one of those places where you know you're sort of it's in the west village and you're sort of cashing on this kind of like hipster masculinity where like you're allowed to be a bit of a bro mm -hmm. but you're you know it's definitely definitely like banter t banter town central even though you know we're a little bit above it yeah but i can't engage in that at all it just intimidates <laughs> me so much that i shut down i uh, i don't say word to my barber for the entire time <laughs> that he's cutting my hair i'm not the and most like, conversational and like he, he's irish you know he likes the crack mm -hmm. you know he he banters with his fellow barbs and he always tries at least once to engage me in conversation over the course of this yeah. thing and i just don't give him anything did you say he likes to crack like, he likes he, the crack c-r-a-i-c I see, I see. Not, not not the crack cocaine. No, he's Irish. I took it to mean like he likes the, the crack and wise. But, uh, I, I believe that's this, where that comes from, although I, I could see. be entirely mistaken. Hey, uh, uh, linguists in the audience, tell me where <laughs> the Gaelic term crack derives from. Mm. But anywho, um, we're back in the desert. We're about to encounter a, philo a philosopher. We're about, to, <laughs> we're about to encounter a colossus. <laughs> I definitely used the wrong form of colossus there. <laughs> yeah. I like that so much. <laughs> we're about to encounter a philosopher. And we're I about, wish it we're so. about to test his thesis. The philosopher who lives in these ruins. <laughs> this is. Uh, I don't know if I've actually gotten this out during this episode. This is maybe my favorite one in the game. I think you're absolutely right. I never got to tell the... The, my favorite thing about going to the barber. Go on. And it's not this will the be part, the good visual to accompany that. It's not the part where he shaves the back of my neck with a straight razor, even though that's lovely. It's the part where he, like, without warning, clamps a hot, like, lemon verbena scented towel over my face <laughs> and rubs my face. Wow, that's some real like, barbershop without stuff. My expectation or consent. <laughs> and I never remember that it's going to happen until he does it. We need to stop and acknowledge what's happening on the screen. I'm sorry. Because it's really, really good. That critter is a lamprey of some description? Oh, it's a dragon. It's, it's basically a dragon. It's hella unworldly. It, it has like some underwater qualities about its oh my god! Oh my god, the way that it's long <laughs> enough that separate parts of it yeah. seem like separate, you know, <laughs> things that are drifting above you in the sky is pretty great. Yeah. You have to fight a spaceship, dude. That's a spaceship. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's like mother ship. It's like that part in Half-Life 2 with the, you know, with the thing. And this is the area that I mentioned earlier, where we're surrounded, where we are... Surrounded entirely by glare. <laughs> That's true, but the air environment includes, is what I'm trying to say, these rings from the Ico Castle. Yes, this is, it's, this is some undulating sci-fi bullshit right here. Yep. That critter... There is no 
critter in this world that corresponds to that critter. <laughs> I'm sorry. I was going to go to bat for the muskox slash toad slash turtle, but not yeah, this guy. This is his own kind of thing. He is so pretty. He's like a, a you know... You know how there's been a, a sort of a mania for videos of uh, sea slugs and other uh, sort of frilly underwater critters on, on, the, on the internet lately? Sure. He's one of those. Yeah. Although I'm a little bit concerned about his sacks. Oh, did you deflate one of his sacks? I did. Well, oh, God, the boat's freaking out a little. They're oh. like mushroom puff balls. He's a fungus. <laughs> That's what he is. He's yeah, a they, fungus. They are, they are a bit like... Um, Spore producing sacks of some kind. That's what I said. They're they're yeah. they're, they're mushy puffballs, and and that's what his real world analog is: is the mushrooms that you see growing. That's what he is. <laughs> the mushrooms that you see. <laughs> yeah, those. Would, I'm assuming that they exist. Yes. Oh man! And because you're in the desert, you're full of particulate anyway. This guy is. Um, the landscape getting between me and him. This is some serious like, and with those spikes of light and the purple clouds, this is some serious like. 1970s sci-fi magazine cover bullshit right here. <laughs> yes. One more egg sack or oh, whatever. It's definitely a, a, a. It's definitely where he keeps his spores. My, I did it even though the horse's head was blocking my view of the target. Oh, that's an okay, excellent now, shot now of Agar's butt. It's time now to see if I can do the thing, okay. the thing that we've just practiced. I'm, I'm really looking forward to this. Get up on the horse. Uh, Get no, up. You're incorrect. Stand up. <laughs> Get up. Stand up. <laughs> no. I will not do that. <laughs> All right. You, you got this. Your, your side's straddling. Yeah. I'm trying to get up. Seems up. awkward. Yeah. Ah. You, I've, I've th fallen that, off the horse. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I think this you is, should get back on the horse. I, I I didn't get to practice sufficiently. <laughs> all right. All right, dude. All right, dude. All right, dude. Dude. All right, dude. You really dude. have to get up on the front. Okay. Yeah. The front it is. Oh man, he's having trouble staying in the air. Yeah, it's because I killed his sacks. They're instrumental to his aviation. Oh, his sacks. Get up, stand up. I hope he stays down for long enough for me to do this. I guess it would look okay if I stood on top. That would, that like it makes some sense as preparing to leap off my horse. Yeah, yeah, do it. Ah! Jump! Oh! oh, it's not easy. Abject failure. Oh, this is so good. You're right. This is the best Colossus. This is <laughs> this is a completely wackadoodle experience. I mean, it, it sacrifices some of the you know empathy. It's hard to even think Are you of that thing. He's majestic. I know, but it, he. I mean, I can't see his face and his cute little eyes. I guess I sort we of. We did can. get a shot of it. This must be very but, unpleasant. All the sand and all. Yeah. No, but he seems he seems more slightly more like. Thoroughly alien than one. You might can't expect. really steer the way you want to while you're doing this. This is, uh, oh, I could have got on there, dude. Just jump onto the thing. Oh my God, you think that's not what I'm trying to do? I I think that I'm, I think that maybe our gaming channel would be better <laughs> if you were just better at video games. Than maybe you you're right. That. Maybe you should be playing all the video games. You know what? I think that if I were playing this boss, <laughs> it would bring a certain je ne sais quoi to the experience. <laughs> I think we would JNA say exactly qua. <laughs> <laughs> you think we would, would I don't know exactly what? Exactly. <laughs> it would be Isaac's bad at video games. I Here we go. I, I, Horse is too slow. We I, have to do it the stupid looking way. We have to sacrifice our dignity and get on this Colossus like an like, dumb like an absolute fool. Because Iroh can't go fast while I'm like standing on top of him. Okay, here we go. Hop! <laughs> <laughs> it didn't even work. <laughs> it's hard. It's not easy. Wait, it did oh, work. Whoa, whoa, okay. Well, hold on. Am I holding on? Hold on. Where am I? Oh my yes. god, I can't even see over the goddamn. Uh, you, you, you hit the other nib while you when you fell yeah. off the first nib. That must have hurt a lot. Uh, you don't seem damaged at all. No, I don't. But it must have hurt. Okay, and now it's a sand speeder race kind of it's a getting thing. Getting up in the air again. The music changes. All right. This is the fight that this music was written for. Yeah. Ha! Ah, oh god. Oh, how about I... Hold on to whatever you're holding on to. Oh god, he's okay. such a crustacean. Weak point. He's a, he's a hairy lobster. You hit stab the weak point and the flap, <laughs> flap just shuts on you. Yeah, I can't remember how this gets difficult at this point. Maybe the answer is it doesn't, and now that I'm on top of him, we're good. Oh. And that's why I was trying to kill time, you see. 
I don't know, this could be a two Colossus episode. It I don't be. know. I think well, you got to find his next weak point. I think though. the next one is also quite complicated. I mean, there aren't the, there aren't that many places for his weak points to be. He's quite long. It is, he but on his tail. he's 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 the life form equivalent of a long narrow hallway. Not a not a difficult place to search. Well, you're a long narrow hallway, <laughs> aren't you, darling? Uh, this is beautiful. This is completely beautiful. I bet it's under this flap. Yeah. Hey, check it out. Stabs. Oh, the flaps. Indeed, the flaps. Uh -huh. Well, let's wait for the flap to retract. Or will it? How do I make him do it? Is there some other thing here? Hmm. Oh, he's gonna... Oh, yeah, that's what happens. You remember now? Yeah, he goes under the sand. Oh. The liquid sand. Oh, okay. And it hurts a little bit. Yeah. This is not a two classes episode, Josh. Nope. Not You're quite. You're gonna have to get back... <laughs> on no. my horse. <laughs> or you could just like fall down on the sand. That looked really comfy. <laughs> Loyal uh, aggro. I'm gonna make two dishes tonight. That's I'm gonna make two dinners and save one of them. What are you gonna make? I'm gonna make sausage pasta and I'm gonna make chicken soup. I'm gonna do both of those. Wow, that's wonderful. And by the time I'm done, it's gonna be like ten o'clock. <laughs> and then you'll and be then really I'll, hungry. And then I'll have a late dinner, and then I won't be able to go to sleep. And then tomorrow. Let me have a nice tomorrow. Sip of my I, coke. I will record a punk rock song. Delicious. In my bedroom. Yeah. Life is life is okay. Life is good. It's I mean, you gotta keep busy. That's We're the, that's surrounding the ourselves with the things we care about. I went and saw uh, my old friend Jay on Monday first yesterday, first time in ages. Yeah, how was that? It's cool. Nice. Just living out in a part of Brooklyn that I've never been to before, out on the J line. Wow. Which and is Jay appropriate on the line, when you yeah. think about it, yeah. No, I didn't I thought about that at the time, but I felt that she'd probably already heard that joke before. <laughs> Yep, probably. That's okay. Our audience may not have. Hey! <laughs> oh, look at those mushroom puffs. <laughs> They're so you can kind of You can imagine what they'd be like oh, for the touch, man, right? Oh, look at that thin. snoot! <laughs> that entirely um, Solid practical horchery. snoot shot. And good horchery, too. Yeah. But All is right. it sword horchery? Now it is. Uh, <laughs> it's about to become sword horchery. Horchery is pointless without the sword. Uh oh. Can I go over this smoothly? Yeah, good enough. Alright. Making our Ready way. for the silly thing? Ready for the silly thing. I think the silly thing is by far. I'm sad that we're gonna get through this entire game without me mastering the non silly thing. Hop! <laughs> no. Shit. I think that you have not even mastered the silly thing, much less the non silly well, thing, yes. TVQH. But the non silly thing is followed basically by the same controls as the silly thing. I'm gonna get on top of the Colossus. I'm gonna stab one more of his weak points, and then I'm gonna repeat this process. Give him a good vibes. See, this guy is beautiful enough that I don't mind being asked to do this again. Mm. Yeah, no, this experience. This is whole, <laughs> this whole thing is worth savoring. <laughs> oh, I don't know why I found that as funny as I did, <laughs> but oh lord, that was hilarious. Uh, makes me feel bad. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm. I What's mean, happening? I'm not laughing at you so much as why I. Why is am. there a big plume in the sand there? Um, maybe he spanked the sand with his tail in celebration of your repeated failure to climb on him st yeah, and stab him in the bits. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. He's waiting so patiently to go back in the air until I'm on top of him. Yeah. And I'm being a big dick. I... yes. Hey, you know, oh. Are you kidding me? <laughs> that works. <laughs> no, what? it doesn't! That's... I don't even understand what happened there. Oh, Josh. Yes? I, this, this, you know what this content has become? What? Relatable. <laughs> you keep trying to climb on top of a space land prey, <laughs> and somehow you just can't hold on. Yeah, it's. I've got the space land prey blues. It's... Oh, I, when you don't have any depth <laughs> perception, you thought you were on one side of the thing, but you were really on the other. I've got the space land prey blues. God, that wasn't where I was going with that, but I appreciate that you went there. Uh, um, I was going to go for like a a kind of a, oh, you spilled coffee in your lap. What can you do? Kind of have a Snickers commercial, but yeah. this worked out. Oh, aggro. A rock? I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry I drove you into a rock. Maybe your problem is that you're driving a horse. <laughs> All right, here we go. Here we go. This is it. This is it. Yeah. 
Just hold on. I had a really good feeling about that one. Yeah, that worked out. Come on, clamber boy. I'm clambering like a champ here. Yeah. This is like, this is like he makes me feel like Ico for the first time now. He's being a real clamber boy right now. That's true, he is. Yeah, that reminds me of, of climbing up those um, diagonal water areas in Ico. The ones which exist only to make you sad if you pick the wrong one first. <laughs> I can't quite remember what you mean, but uh, that does sound like the kind of thing that would be in that game. There were water slides in that game. It was part of the fun Climber Boy activities in ICO. Was there were water slides. Yeah, you remember. No, I don't. You had to turn the water off if you wanted to climb up the slide. And you had to clamber along the wall in order to get to the top. But there were two like nearly identical ones. And no, never mind. I remember there's, there there's being... There's video evidence. I remember this. some of this existing. I don't remember there being like two and like you have to get lucky and pick the right one. Oh well, maybe we maybe there were we just got lost, but it definitely yeah. Who knows? It's it's you know I mean what this is evidence that I need to replay that game because again what what good is Ico in my mind if I can't if I don't have like a perfect mental map of that entire castle? You literally <laughs> recorded it. You can just go back. Yeah, and watch. but that's not the same thing. I know, but it has the added bonus of Isaac and Josh content. Yeah, younger Isaac and Josh. Those videos are weird for me to watch at this point. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! We're gonna, gonna do it again. Do it a third time. I guess let's hop off him because it's painful. When, well, maybe this is gonna be more painful. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was a little yeah. more painful, but I'm fine. Fundamentally, I'm fine. You should have. I get to look at this now, that's kind of nice. I think you should have hopped off, like, just before he did that. <laughs> but this is such a good view. Zoom. Uh, well, I think we've got some time to, to kill here. Well, better. Uh, you going to get on the horse in a particularly good way? Oh, <laughs> no, you're going to stab your horse. I'm trying to pet my horsey. There we go. I'm sorry I hit you with a sword. It's okay. That sword is notional. It only works to kill colossuses. <laughs> it's, oh, it's a magic sword, yeah. I've never seen you harm anything by um, by smacking it with your sword except a tiny lizard and then you have to hit the tiny lizard like three or four times so you can't hurt that much uh, unless you count me whacking the turtle's molars I as harming so, it well it didn't do any damage though it didn't do any damage it was just like uh, you were possibly feeding signals directly into its brain but <laughs> I was steering it towards its death I mean that's I kind mean, of that, like harming I mean, it yeah but it's like you weren't steering aggro towards its death that's true. Unless, except in the sense that you're staring <laughs> aggro towards its death. But... <laughs> yeah, by putting it through all this. Uh huh. No, no, we've given up on gendering aggro at all now. I I only did that because you we had already been established the phrase of the Colossus. Aggro yeah. is still proudly female horse. <laughs> <laughs> Strong horchery. Yeah, that's pretty good. All right. Now might be my last chance to do the thing correctly. You're not gonna. And the more that you do it... Yeah, I guess I, I'll... Well, I tell, I tell you what. You know what's how you succeeded last time? How? Is you got in front of it and let it approach you. That's true, and but so that that wouldn't, I don't think that would be helpful when it comes to the thing I want to do. Well, it would mean that you wouldn't have to be going fast. That's true. Oh, God, no! <laughs> it's the close. rock. You're, you're great nemesis. Let's just do it like a normal asshole. Yeah, see, that didn't work, did it? Not yet. No, it didn't. <laughs> you might as well stick to your guns at this point. Get well ahead of it. Stop chasing it, because that clearly doesn't work. You know, yeah. go around in a big circle. Meet it on its, its way. Its course is kind of complicated. Yeah, you know, you got to use some of your tact to, to figure out that it's now moving away from you. Are again. doing the standing up on top of horse move, or the get down to side of horse move, though? Get down, get down. Get down. I don't think that'll work. Get down a horse. Let's try though. All right. Like I need to. Uh, I bl this is, it's gonna be so it, hard. It's gonna be so classy. <laughs> it's gonna look so. It's it's gonna make the game like the movie that you so desperately want it to be. Yeah. Um. Cinematography is important. Yeah, there you go. But milk that frame, dude. Use every inch of that canvas. See, it's just. If I could steer the horse from here, this would be a different story. Oh man, oh, I didn't even God. do it right to get back on top of the horse. You were way too far away from it when you made the move. I know, I know. Oh, I wait, was... wait, you have, you have another if chance! I... You have another chance! Here's it! Hey! It's not gonna... Uh... <laughs> yes! Yes! This is gonna work! It's... No, I grabbed onto the horse. See, that's, that's the part of the puzzle I didn't have time to solve before you got impatient. Is the part where you jump off the horse and that grab angle? grab onto it immediately? Like it's something, it's some interaction with the grab move and the fact that I'm in the air next to the horse. 
It's horror. It's horrible. It's horror. <laughs> it's horror. Whatever, I'm gonna do this like a jackass. Okay, okay. Hey, that looked pretty good. It looked okay. That looked pretty good. There was a moment where the horse was kind of running directly into the fin. You gotta get that primo footage. Dude. Yeah, well, we already discussed that that is how you are good at video games, is by doing that, so... Always. I'm just trying to have conviction yeah. to, our, to our premise and our theme. Oh, I mean, that, it's sort of like, you know, when we're playing a, a, a hard video game together, you tend to choose to make... <laughs> oh, God! You tend to choose to make it even harder for yourself. Yeah. You eschew all matter of... <laughs> uh, of tips and tricks, and when the game is like slightly broken in a way that's to your advantage, you don't tend to take advantage of it. Yeah. And I think that that's what makes you good at video games, well, is that you, you are always trying to make the experience better in spite of how bad the actual programmers are at making the game. Yeah. You are working with and occasionally against the game to make it a better game via your play style. It's, it's just a matter of Which, like, it, making the, effort to maximize your experience. The exact opposite of what you did in that Dishonored video. Yeah, yeah, and I'm working on, like, more Dishonored footage where I play it correctly. Uh -huh. But, like, you know, that's that's just... You have to do that kind of thing to, to see what you're working with, you know? Yeah. Anyway, this guy's gonna die, and it will approximately be the amount or the right amount of time for an episode. Of yeah, Shadow see, of the I, didn't, I didn't stop you from your horse shenanigans too soon. <laughs> <laughs> I gave you exactly the right amount of time for horse shenanigans. Ah, uh, rest in peace, Space Lamprey. Oh, he's beautiful even in death. He's picked a very look dramatic at that way to die. Oh, look at those flippers. Oh! <laughs> I knew those flippers uh, so well. Sting, I do confess it. Wow, wow, wow. If I should die, I think only this of me. That I'll stab you with doom tentacles. You just have to stand and meet your death sometimes. Zoot! Oh, man. They didn't even have the tendency to blot out the sky. They just <laughs> went right through the ground. And... <laughs> Oh and yeah, they never <laughs> saw him again. <laughs> see, I'm must, I'm becoming more like the Colossi through the through these darkness infusions. You see, I've learned how to swim through sand. Mm. By swim through, you mean collapse <laughs> into and be lost to the yeah. edge. Yes, yes. So there aren't that many left. Are there two left? Is that mm. how many? I'm gonna sing you a little song. Okay. This is from the end of Oedipus Tex by P.D.Q. Bach. All right. So the moral of the story is, of course. Don't love your mother, partner, save it for your horse. Horse. I can guarantee that you will be filled with great remorse. If you give your mother love, you should be saving for your horse. Horse. Save it for your horse. You've got to save it for your horse. Your horse. Don't be a prisoner of remorse. Remorse. Take love and save it for your horse. Your horse. Yes, thank you. That's a good song. <laughs> I'm, we've only sang two horse songs on this series so far, and there's like, there's got to be way more. I'm sure there are. We can spend I mean, way more time singing horse horse songs while we're like struggling to find things to talk about. I mean, hello, we've been overlooking. We this. just went through a desert on a horse with no name. <laughs> oh my god! It has a name. It has a name. Damn it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, this one. This one. I'm a little leery little, about. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We'll see though. A Is city. It, well, that's exciting. Yeah, yeah. It's kind of cool. It's, there's, I think there's going to be some figuring out on that one. Well, I'm looking forward to that. A little bit of Italo Calvino action. Since we've got about a spare minute here, let's right, right. let's just check in on the Colossus statues real quick. I think there are how maybe many, three how many left. Two left we have to do. Oh yeah, I remember all three now. Um, I don't. I what, what, what did I call them last time? Uh, who knows? But uh, this guy's next, and then there's this guy. Mm. Hello, horse. This guy's got a knife, <laughs> so you got to be careful of him. Um, and then there's the last guy. Uh, he looks like a guy. Yeah. So getting close to the the end here. Alrighty. Checking you... in on my terrible face. Mm, yep. Look, looking yep. pretty grim there. Yeah. At least I still have my anime eyes. All right, Bobos. Um, oh, look at this this wrecked cathedral. It's really pretty. Yeah. I will stick. I will stick. I will catch you on the flippy. Hey. Bye. Oh, that's the wrong button. Oh.